Um, sometimes I feel like y'all request stuff just so you can see this perplexed look on my face. This the look you wanted. <laughs> oh man, y'all. Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl Kim B back again for another reaction. Today we've got Arca with Kick Two, y'all. I don't know who this is. I think they used to be a producer or something like that. The the cover art is a, 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 a pretty wild. I'm thinking this is somebody who's eclectic, kind of off the wall in their own lane type of thing. Um, I put this in a poll. Y'all voted for this pretty high. And uh, I keep seeing it in the comments So I don't know what y'all got me getting into I'm, I'm trusting y'all on this I'm going into this blind But uh, yeah we got um, We got uh, 12 tracks Don't think I've heard any of this But you know sometimes you hear stuff And you don't realize it was this person So I'm trusting y'all on this Y'all wanted me to do kick two While I was looking for it I also saw that there was other uh, like a kick one kick three or something I'm like no they asked for kick two so this is what we going with okay <laughs> without further ado y'all let's get into it Arca kick two track one yo Con desempado, con desempado, Waiting for the beat. Is that it? Okay. Yo. Yo, this is wild. What y'all got me into, yo? That's how the album opens up. What y'all got me into, yo? Okay. So, is the whole thing in Spanish? I'm assuming this is all in Spanish, right? Um, maybe we'll see. But for that reason, I'm not gonna be able to really comment on the lyrical context. But uh, I'm going off of my uh, the vocals and the instruments and my emotions. So let's go. Yo, okay, they had a nice beat on it, can't lie. Okay. Rakata. Only Rakata I know is. Rakata, Rakata. I see why y'all want to be listed. It's it got some nice beats on it though, some fire beats. Okay, my ex my expectations have raised now. Come on. Okay, that's a fave. Uh huh. Oh. Uh-huh, let's go. Uh. Mango bajito, dale despacito, luego te acelera, suavemente, 
suavemente, que ver suavemente, de dedo de frente. Suavemente. So interesting, like interesting, like selection of sounds and instruments and effects on here. This ain't just the typical like reggae tone, Spanish sounding beats and you know rhythms. This is like kind of really off the wall. It's like familiar sounds and unfamiliar sounds in one. You know what I mean? It's not typical. I like that. Okay. So this is a little bit more gentler, not as hard hitting as the past two tracks. This one felt kind of eerie, kind of ghostly and haunting, kind of chilling. You know what I'm saying? Dale flow, dale, que dale flow, dale, papi, dale flow, dale, dale flow, dale, dale. Let's roll, mommy. Let's go, papi. Let's, let's, let's go, okay. papi. They speak, let's, they speak let's, in English let's now. Let's show, papi. In You know what? This whole project feels very kind of like I'm going to do what I want to do. Forget the typical, you know, song structure. Forget all that. This is how I'm feeling. This is the sounds I want to use. Let's play around with this. Let's add this over there. This is how I feel. Just very kind of free spirited. No structure necessarily, you know. OK. All right. All right. <laughs> I feel like I'm in outer space. Ooh. Sound real robotic, real robotic, futuristic elements. I feel like I'm in a whole nother realm right now. Where am I? <laughs> Y'all answer me this. Everybody who is is vibing and feeling this and who's who's been listening to this since it came out, if you are Arca fan, under is it just for the sake of listening or under what circumstances would you put this on? This particular track, specifically number 7. What circumstances would you throw this on? Like do you have this on while you cleaning? Like what? You know what I'm saying? Like I'm just I'm just curious to know. Like, I personally can't think of, I mean, do you put it on while you driving? You know what I'm saying? Like, I can't think of a, a, a circumstance where I would be like, you know what? I want to hear Aranya from, from uh, Kick 2. Like, I can't I can't hear myself saying I want to hear number seven again. You know what I'm saying? So, sound off in the comments. Let me know y'all thoughts on this, man. I'm really curious to know. This is interesting. Or is it just for the sake of listening, you know, to the creativity and the art, you know? Could just be a entertaining listening experience and nothing else. Y'all let me know. So look, the beginning of the the beginning of the album had me intrigued, fascinated, and and and, and engaged. But now he's start starting to kind of lose me, starting to lose me a little bit. Bring me back, baby. Bring me back. What else you got for me? Let's go. Bam. Okay. Give me something, baby. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Yeah. What's up? Mm. What's up? Mm. 
Okay, so yeah, this just felt kind of like an interlude. Not a lot to it. We got this and three more after this. Is there any lyrics that are going to come back? We just listen to music now. That's cool, too. That's cool, too. Okay. Oh. It didn't go in the direction I thought it was going just now. <laughs> yeah, man, you know, this is weirdly kind of eclectic and unpredictable. Um, sometimes I feel like y'all request stuff just so you can see this perplexed look on my face. This the look you wanted. <laughs> oh man, y'all, y'all wilding on this, man. I like the keyboards, the piano. Wish we could get more of that. More of that extended. And it's just kind of lingers. Okay, Born Yesterday. I'm assuming this is in English. It's an English title. Something's wrong and I can feel it. Okay. And if the surface tension breaks, then we will drown. Okay. You gotta go now. To see you word of Ooh, okay. Don't call me baby. You know, it was refreshing to hear a familiar voice. It's, it's re refreshing to hear Sia's powerful vocals. Now, I feel like the vocals are not the focus of this album. The sounds are. The different uses of different sounds and effects. Because on some of those parts, her vocals was kind of drowned out a little bit, which I'm sure that was intentional. This the finale right here, y'all. So we'll see where it goes. Yo. This just in time for Halloween. This feels scary. Oh, okay. Take me somewhere, baby. Yeah, do y'all freestyle over this, man? What y'all be doing with these type of sounds? Okay, a quick fade out there. We got another 30 seconds. They start fading it. Yo. You know, when the album first started... I was very open-minded and it started going in the direction that I was really feeling. Interesting. You know, when the album first started, it was going in a direction that um, I was really feeling and kind of dancing to. And I'm like, okay, okay, I see what y'all, yeah, I see why y'all recommended this. But then once we kind of got to the middle, I was like, okay, a lot of it's instrumentation, which is cool, but it wasn't really hitting my spirit. It wasn't really, you know, that's why I asked y'all, you know, under what circumstance do you put this on? 
when you're cleaning when you're driving how does this make you feel you know what i'm saying um i would say my faves is i'm sure y'all will know my faves is Rakata and Prada. <laughs> Them was the joints I was vibing out to, man. Yeah, definitely. Um, it's it's cool every now and then to throw something in on the channel that I'm not used to or not familiar with. You know what I'm saying? Some kind of off the wall. This was definitely kind of. I probably would have never just randomly listened to this album on my own. You know what I mean? Um, I believe this person is a producer uh not too familiar with any previous works or anything like that i believe i've heard the name before but not really familiar with their work um so yeah this was wild and, and like it's just really wild but shout out to arkham man uh you did your thing you you are definitely in your own lane um i'm just trying to let this marinate for a while y'all mm. It was just such a variety of different sounds, man. Not a lot of lyrics. And then even the lyrics that were on here were in Spanish. So, couldn't say too much about that. Kick 2, what is that about? Like, it's, I feel so in the dark on a lot of stuff. I'm sure some of y'all are going to drop down in the comments and give a whole... Um, some of you all who, who are familiar with Arca will probably let me know a little bit more about this. But, uh, wow. Yeah yeah interesting um yeah i'm kind of at a loss for words man y'all wanted this y'all better justify this reaction with the views i swear <laughs> you ain't gonna see no more no more arca on the channel if y'all don't justify this with the views but um it's your girl can be y'all like the video baby what you doing i did this for you like the video um definitely not something that i will probably listen to again except for the two faves i pointed out um but i respect art man i respect artists i respect creativity just because it didn't really hit my soul don't mean it ain't brilliant you know what i'm saying so uh anyway i'm gonna i'm gonna I'm let this linger with me for a while <laughs> Yeah, like the video drop down in the comments let me know what you thought have you heard of arca was this your first time too did you only listen to this because you because you are loyal to me <laughs> you know some people watch the video for me some people watch the video for the artist so let me know in the comments y'all it's your girl can be and uh, i will see y'all in the next one